Sharon and Hickory with a thriller tonight in our WKBN Game of the Week. Tigers took the early lead. Lamont Austin fighting through the D, had a team-high 13 points, but Hickory would make a run in the fourth quarter. Ryland Dye was unbelievable. They swing it around to him, and he knocks down a triple to make it a one-point game. Then Dye with another take, goes strong to the hoop and picks up the foul. He had 19 points. This game would go to overtime. It all comes down to this. Sharon Sr., Mr. Ham at the line, down one with two free throws and seven seconds left. Ham knocks down the first to tie it, so one more to win. Here's Chad Krasinski with the result in the final seven seconds. Mr. Ham with the Hornet fans making a boatload of noise. Mr. Ham puts it up and in. It's a one-point lead. Hornets now have to go. Up the floor comes Marco Miller. Ryland dive to the line, to the lane. Puts it up and in. It's a game winner at the buzzer. How about Hickory? The Hornets stun Sharon at the buzzer, 50 to 49. People dream of that. You know, ever since I was a little kid watching Peyton Mel, Donna Whitehead, I've dreamed to be in this moment. So it feels good for sure, and especially to get a, a win over rival Sharon. It feels good. I told Ryland, I said, you got to get the ball, and you got to drive the whole way down because their coach is definitely telling them no fouls. And to Ryland's credit, that was a great defensive play. He put it up off the glass, and uh, big players make big plays, and he certainly did that.